two people. The man 40930. Alex Killings 97. Working together to bring you the best gaming videos ever. I love scary games. The fact is, Soon oh, you ready. That, 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 I time. think that, that that actually talking just scared the hell out of me. Anyway, so I think I'm gonna go this way. Not knowing where I'm going. Alright, so that's where I came from. That was the kitchen. He escaped. Where is he now? Okay, wait, what's over here? Go check these rooms. I don't know where I'm going. Oh, okay, I have a man in these rooms. Awesome, because there's a tinder box over here. And, hang on, just gotta fill up with my oil. Fill up with my oil. Anything in here? Hang on, was this, uh, with a note? Yeah, that's with a note. A note. And then I went over here. So I'm at a giant loop, I think. Yeah, that's what I did. And then... No, 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 I went up this way. Okay, okay. Uh, the gate is locked and the pack lock is... Uh, uh. Oh no, why didn't that work? Oh my god. <laughs> um, uh, so, yeah, I'm not going to be doing any Call of Duty uh, gameplay, let's plays at all. None. There are, I already have some up for zombies, but that's it. Yeah, if I were to do any Call of Duty, it would be zombies, but I highly doubt I'm doing it. I just don't like Call of Duty. I'm sorry, guys. Don't don't tell me oh, we want Call of Duty. I just can't play Call of Duty. I'm a Battlefield 3 man. I'm a Battlefield 3 boy. It's in a very poor condition. Alright, so hang on. Can I use, like, this? Uh, pallet? What? The pallet won't break. It needs to be weakened further. Ah, uh, screw! Um... Hang on, I'm gonna go to the group health and help me. That was good. How it? What is that? What have I used that surgical needle for? See, I won't be doing that. I will be doing BF3 videos. Hey, um, you! Stop! Don't cut any closer! I just said... <laughs> maybe more to I don't know. You can't go outside! It's too dangerous! I'm telling Gabriel! I doubt that very much. I'm just gonna mark my checkpoint here. Uh, I can't, it doesn't work! It doesn't work! Um. No. No, 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 no. Oh god, no, 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 no. Oh, please don't tell me this is the locked one. Oh, it's the locked one. Oh, no, 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 Just here, my Battlefield 3 experience I had a couple of days ago. Anyway, last time on Battlefield 3, I uh, played I uh, multiplayer. I didn't play as a sniper much, as a recon guy, really at all. Uh, no, I just couldn't get used to it. But I decided, oh, you know what? I'm gonna do it just to improve it and get levels up. I am a pretty good recon guy. I have a great uh, sniper now, and it's completely changed. Um, on this, this one map on the server, basically the um, they had it so it was like a thousand credits conquest. It was so fun to be in this building and just to defend this thing and guys just coming in, ba bang, in the head. And one time, uh, one guy, I um, basically I uh, someone knifed me from from behind, but I had my uh, my spawner thing, my uh, spawn, the thing I placed down. 
Uh, he, he didn't see it, so he, he camped up there. So he's like, he's sitting there where I was sitting, just where I was sitting, didn't pay attention to my spawn thing. I respawned, <laughs> crept up behind him, knifed him, and then some other guys just came from nowhere and just shot me down. So that was pretty exciting. And we, we obviously won. No, I'm just kidding, we lost. Still a very, very exciting battle. Yeah, I'm just gonna go. Just wait one second. Yeah. Uh, hang on, was it? Yeah, okay, that was where the rocks were. Okay. Okay. It won't budge. That's great. Okay, that's where the, uh, that the excellent lock, uh, condition thing was. Um, have I gone up here? I, I think I Oh, I okay, I think this is where we're supposed to go. Alright, there's already a light in here. That's awesome. I'm just gonna guess if there's no monsters in here. I probably am wrong. And why, why is it glowing green? Ugh. Oh. Um. Do I, 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 okay. It's 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 really freaky. All right. So things I have as mementos. This is a barrel filled with acid. <laughs> the gate leading out of this area is locked by a pawn lock. Oh, okay, 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 okay. I need a bottle. To fill this acid up. Okay, just run here. Nice no, lantern. Let's get this bottle, empty it out, and then dump it in the acid. It's too narrow for the glass to be filled with acid. We're in the acid. The glass container is not okay. What about this? Uh, let's do this. <laughs> Great acid. <laughs> just smash it. A glass container. What the hell? What's that? Oil. Awesome. A glass container. Who the hell's seen a glass container? I've never seen a glass container. What the hell's a glass container? I've never seen one of these glass containers in my life. Alright, so I'm guessing that's what the other area is for, to find that glass container. And I've obviously... 4th of August, 1839. The nightmares woke me in the early morning. And for a moment, I forgot where I was. Shortly after, there was a knock on my door. Alexander had heard my screams and asked me to join him in the parlor. As we drank our tea, Alexander began to tell me what he knew. It seems like the orb I found casts a long and dark shadow. It's not only a powerful item, but a dangerous one. Simply by touching it, you invoke the powers within. And if you are too weak to control it, it will devour you. The shadow is a sluggish thing, lagging behind the wielder, killing anyone or anything in its path to reclaim the orb. I said I didn't care about its powers and that I should throw it away. Alexander advised against this as I'd still be a part of the path to the orb and eventually suffer death. Having the orb, I would at least have the chance to fight back when the time came. I asked Alexander what he meant when he said he could protect me. And he answered that things can be done, but at a price. Ooh, this is starting to get shaggy. I have no idea what that means. I don't know, I'm just tired actually. <sighs> I'm a bit tired. Hey, I think that's that door that wouldn't budge from before. Maybe. No, probably not. Oh, I've been staying at 3 o'clock in the morning, usually at 2 o'clock, listen to my iPod or, yeah, listen to a lot of podcasts. Okay, i got to be really careful, I'm just not. <laughs> I've got to be really careful, I'm just not being careful. I, oh, a chair. Mr. Chair, you, you stay watch here. Um, if you see any monsters...